According to the multiplication principle, if an operation can be carried out in n sub 1 ways, and another operation can be carried out in n sub 2 ways, then the number of ways to carry out both the operations consecutively is n sub 1 times n sub 2. This is also called the fundamental principle of counting or FPC. Pag binalikan natin tong problem na to by the fundamental principle of counting, so we'll have 3 times 2, which is 6. First operation can be done in 3 ways. Second operation can be done in 2 ways. So that's 3 times 2 equals 6. Um, restricted lang ba to sa dalawang operations? Well, hindi. So we have the general principle of, uh, general multiplication principle. In a sequence of processes, if the first process can be done in n sub 1 ways, the second in n sub 2 ways, and the third in n sub 3, and so on, after the kth process, the total number of ways the whole process can be done is just the product of everyone. n sub 1 times n sub 2 up to n sub k. Example number 3, a restaurant offers two types of rice, three desserts, four viands, and three drinks. How many combinations of meals are there? You can pause the video, give this a try, and then come back. Okay, so, ilan, mm -hmm. Ilang operations or actions yung kaya natin gawin? Um, una, pipili tayo ng rice. Rice. And then, pipili tayo ng dessert. And then, we're going to choose the viand. And then, we're going to choose the drinks. The rice, we can do that in two ways. There are two different types of rice. And then, three types of desserts. Four kinds of viands. And then, three drinks. And all we have to do by the generalized multiplication principle, we'll have to do is to multiply this to get the total number of combinations of meals. So we have 2 times 3, that is 6 times, what's 6 times 12? 72. So there are 72 combinations. 72 combinations. Okay, let's have example number 4. San Pablo Colors makes custom paints using a base, a texture, and a pigment. If the store has 4 different bases, 3 different textures, and 40 different pigments, how many different custom paints can be mixed? Mm. For this case, all we have to do is to apply the generalized multiplication principle. Pipili muna tayo ng base. Merong apat na choices yung uh, store. And then different textures, meron silang tatlo, and then meron tayong 40 different pigments. So all we have to do is to multiply this. Let's pull out our calculator. We have 4 times 3 times 40 will give us 480. So there are 480 different custom paints ang pwedeng i-offer nung San Pablo colors. Let's have example number 5. How many 3-digit number numbers? Numbers, how many three different numbers can be made from the digits 2, 6, 7, and 9 if letter A, there are no restrictions, letter B, repetition of the digit is not allowed, and letter C, the number, of, the number must be less than 700, and repetition of the digit is not allowed. Let's answer letter A muna. But of course, you can pause the video, tapos kapag okay na, balika. Let's have letter A. There are no restrictions. Okay, so we have to form three-digit numbers. Ibig sabihin, ang operations na gagawin natin dyan, or processes na gagawin natin, ay pipili tayo ng numbers sa hundreds, sa tens, tsaka sa ones. So we have three processes. Uh, tapos, pipiliin natin yung mga numbers sa two, six, seven, tsaka nine. Ibig sabihin, meron tayong apat na choices. If there will be no restrictions, ibig sabihin, um, pwede kahit anong ilagay dun sa trends, hundreds, tsaka sa, sa ones. Tapos, pwedeng umulit yung digits kasi pwede naman umulit. Pwedeng 222, two, two, pwedeng 226, two, two, pwedeng 277, seven, or 677. Seven, seven. So, pwede ka mag-ulit ng numbers, no restrictions. So, ibig sa hundreds, we can er, uh, basically put any of the four digits. Ganun din sa tens at ganun din sa ones. So, the answer for this one, so we have four times four times four, 64 three-digit numbers that will satisfy the first condition. Letter B, repetition of digit is not allowed. Bawal daw, umulit ng digit. We have four different digits to choose from. Two, six, and nine. Two, six, seven, and nine. So, pwede ka mag-start dun sa ones digit, pwede ka din mag-start dun sa hundreds digit. So, in this case, let's start with the hundreds digit. Sa hundreds digit, you can select any of the numbers. So, you have, your, you have four ways to do that. Sa second, sa tens, bawal umulit. So, if, for example, napili mo si two, bawal na ulitin si two. So, ibig sabihin nun, tatlo na lang yung choices mo for the tens. And for the one, since nagamit mo na kunyari si two at si six, so, you will left with 7 and 9. So, you will left with 2 choices na lang. Kasi bawal mag-ulit. 
So what's 4 times 3 times 2? That's 24. So we have 24 three-digit number numbers that can be made from 2, 6, 7, and 9 if repetition of digit is not allowed. And let's have the last one, letter C. The number must be less than 700 and repetition of the digit is not allowed. Must be less than 700. If the digits must be less than 700, ibig sabihin, 600 something pamba, 699 pamba lang yung pwede natin gawing numbers, ibig sabihin... Ang kailangan nating i-consider dito yung hundreds digit, yung first digit. Ang first digit natin ang pwede lang na ilagay diyan ay si 2 at si 6. Tama? Kasi kapag sinama natin si 7, mas mataas ang 700 'yon. Lalo na kapag 9 yung inuna natin, no? So we will remove 7 and 9 from the choices dito sa first digit natin or sa hundreds digit. So we can do this in two ways. Sa third digit natin, as a second digit which is the tens digit. We can choose any from any, any from the 4. Kasi sure na tayo na 2 at 6 na lang yung first digit natin. Eh. So we can select any of the 4 digits. Kaso nagamit na natin yung isa doon. So ibig sabihin, eh, since bawal ang repetition. So we have 3 ways to do that now. 3 na lang. And then for the last digit, yung 4 na yun, pwede pa ulit silang 4. Kaso dalawa na yung nagamit natin. So dalawa na lang yung choices natin for the 1's digit. And get the product of this. We'll get 2 times 3 times 2. That is 12. 12 ways to form 3 digit number from these 4 digits that is less than 700 and repetition of digit is not allowed. Let's have example number 6. There are 4 routes or routes. Routes ba tato siguro? From city A to B and 7 <laughs> routes from city B to C. So 4 and then 7. How many possible routes can you take from city A to C via B? So parang lang yung San Pablo, Kalawan, Kalamba lang kanina. And letter B, how many possible routes can you take from city A to C via B and back? Babalik ka. If you cannot take a particular route twice. If you yung dinaanan mo na papuntang C, nadadaan ka kay B. Ay hindi mo na pwedeng daanan pabalik. And for letter C, how many possible routes can you take from city A to C via B and back if you can use any route? So, pwede mo na daanan yung mga daanan mo na. For number 6, hindi ko sasagutan ito. Um, we will answer this in class. So, this will be part of your homework. But if you know the answer, please do not hesitate to share your answer on the comment box. I will tell you if your answer is correct or not. It's for number 6. Okay? And let's have for number 7. How many 3-digit numbers can be formed from the digits 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5? So there are 6 digits. If each digit can be used only once. I think that's the first question. 3-digit uh, tapos it can be used only once. And then letter A. How many of these numbers are even? Hmm. Ilan daw ng even? How many of these are odd? And letter B. How many numbers are greater than 400? Again, uh, since color green to, let's discuss this in class. But if you already know the answer, please share it to your classmates. Comment down below. And I will let you know if your answer is correct or not. Okay. Um, Take note lang for number 7. You cannot have a hundreds digit na 0. So, bawal ang 0 sa first digit or sa hundreds digit. So, take note of that one.